Hello students, this is the experiment C1C3, measuring the coefficient of linear expansion of solid. Here the solid is brass, as you can see, attached here. And then attached to the brass is the thermometer. We want to find the coefficient of linear expansion of brass. And then the second part is C3, which will be coefficient of cubic expansion of water. First, we run cold water through the brass. Here, this is the tap. Run cold water through the brass. And then we measure the temperature, which is around 23 degrees Celsius. Then, focusing our lens, on the optical lever, which shows here on the ruler, the lower point is 32. It's 31. The lower point is 31 on this spot, and the upper point is 42. So you stick with either the lower point for your readings when the temperature increases, or you stick with upper point for your reading when the temperature increases. Now we're going to pass through the hot steam from air boiling on the stove to the grass. Then we ink as the temperature increases from 23 degrees Celsius, we have to take the readings for distance D on this measuring ruler. Now the temperature is increasing right from the steam connected to the brass. 30. 30. It's 30 degrees, take your reading, either the upper reading or the lower reading. You can see this curve is moving up on the scale. Forty degrees Celsius. Take your reading. Fifty degrees Celsius. Take your reading. Sixty degrees Celsius. Take your reading. Eighty. Eighty degrees Celsius. Take your reading. Ninety. Ninety degrees Celsius. Take your reading. Now it's 94, that is the final temperature, and then we take the final distance B on the ruler to be the final D. As we run the cold water again through the tap and going through the brass, we'll see how the rub move down. Then it will stop at approximately where we started at 23 degrees Celsius. Yeah. Now it's at 23 degrees Celsius. And we have the lower reading to be 31 and the upper reading to be 42.
So you use this to plot your linear graph. Now for C3, to measure the volume expansion of water, we've already measured this container without water inside. Then we measure it with water before putting it on the stove. Once the temperature rises, then you will see bubbles coming up at exactly the highest temperature of boiling water. Then we take it out and when the temperature reaches 94 degrees Celsius, we take this out and we measure it again. Then you can use that to is that to calculate your change in mass as indicated in the manual for C3. As you can see, there are bubbles coming up when the temperature increases. Now the temperature is at 88 degrees Celsius. Looking at the red mercury colored inside the thermometer. So we wait until temperature reaches 90 degrees. We take out the SG bottle and weigh it again as the mass when the temperature increases. Now it's at 90 degrees Celsius. We have the stove and we measure it on the scale. Now we measure it on the scale. Now 85.34. That's the mass at 90 degrees Celsius. Make use of this number to calculate the coefficient of cubic expansion of water.